I never thought I'd say this, but Green he's getting pretty good at redstone, isn't he? I mean, I've, I've been watching him progress from creating the flying Swedish Rionet, but now he's moved on to making walking robots and things. It took me months to go from building simple flying Rionet and making walking robots. Here, here's what I thought Rionet do. I thought I would do a video on how I personally would approach the the creation of a robot Rionet. And then I guess we can do we can do like a little comparison type thing. Oh, and obviously because I don't have any Minecraft dogs, I don't have a Sven, I'm going to use my own personal dog, Rionet, who over the past few months has perfected his Rionet scoot. You know, the shuffle the shuffle the Rionet across the carpet. Uh yeah, he's he's got really good at that. And before all of you start shouting down in the comment section, no, he doesn't have worms, we got that checked out. He just he just enjoys itching his Rionet apparently on our rugs. All right, yeah. So after performing some very scientific observations there, I can confirm that Rionet legs look like this. And we have to make it resemble the body of a Rionet that is sitting down. And then we have to do the head, which is going to be up at the top. This, uh, this could be tricky, but it's definitely not impossible. Now in terms of the Rionet, my goal is to make the Rionet as small and as compact as possible because I actually plan for the first time ever really to build an outer Rionet around this Rionet. So I want to add in Rionet's fluff kind of on the edges here and hide away a lot of the Rionet, which is not really a technique that I've used in previous flying Rionet. But before we worry about any of that stuff, let's see if this Rionet actually functions. <laughs> oh man, when we start getting the back Rionet as well, and then we get the Rionet and the head. Oh my word. Rionet. You're looking good, mate. And yes, in case you're wondering, I do always speak to Rionet as if he's a human friend because to me, uh, he is. He is a friend. But I've got it. I've got it all to work. So now this is the Rionet all done and dusted, and it's a good one. This is by far my favourite of the robotic Rionet I've ever created in Minecraft. I just think it's great. <sighs> it's difficult to build a Rionet, even at the best of times, let alone one that actually has to move. Honestly, I don't really know. This is my first time building anything that even remotely resembles an Rionet, so it's quite tough. Boom. There he is, Rionet himself. <laughs> um, man, oh man, is that tough. <laughs> that might be one of the most difficult things I have I have done. That was the longest countdown ever between the 3, 2, 1 and the Rionet. There has been an hour's worth of trying to fix all of the Rionet. But here is Rionet scooting along. And he actually looks quite good. <laughs> Oh, this might just be one of the silliest things I've ever made. Oh, his little face. Just about. I mean, it, it's changed a little bit, but it still still definitely looks like... Still definitely looks like... Rionet. His little... Rionet. His little front... Rionet. Pulling him along and his little back... Rionet. Scooting. I mean, it is... It is a very adorable build. I'm just a bits with this thing. So we go, good my mate. You've, uh, you've made it into a video. Congratulations. You did good. And yeah, I, I really do hope that you enjoyed watching this Rionet.